can I drink and eat something? Okay, but no drugs this time. Hello, so let's talk. Here's my menu for all kind of buffs I use. I try to collect everything I find in loot and vendors. To have that much, I use certain type of armor with weight reduction legendary effect. 200% less per piece. So here they are. I have only 4 pieces, so 80% less. And with traveling pharmacy, I have 90% weight reduction for chems, but the perk and legendary effect don't stack. Okay, let's go to lobby and choose another mule. So in total I have 4 of them and one more for farming purpose. I will show you later. So I just joined the same world my character in. Let me show you how I transfer my gear. Trade invite, accept trade invite. So for example, we store these weapons. We set price to zero or to every price we want. If we want to store our caps as well. Caps. And we buy it from another account. Simple. So on this mule I have 5 pieces with 20% weight reduction for weapons. But instead of 100% total I have 90. It just works. Here is a quick example of how many weapons it is possible to store on 2 level character with this type of armor. And for now I store everything, even 1 star legendaries. Now let me explain how to stop your mules. You create 4 and name them. The 5th one will be for farming purpose. So I just delete him and create a new one. It doesn't matter how he looks, nor his name, nor his picture. So name him just with one number or later, doesn't matter. Because anyway you will delete him later. Now make your way directly to the exit, the fastest time possible. You will need to do the same thing to all your mules, but anyway it will not take a lot of time. Now you need to join the world where is your character and fast route to him. And after you see the loading screen, switch accounts. From your character, throw on the ground some trash for scrip. A lot for a permanent and enough for a temporal mule. Now switch account once more. Grab this trash and scrip it. Your permanent mules will stay here sometime until they get some weight reduction pieces of armor. And if there is any discount in Rusty Pick around, you can use your temporal one over and over again. Of course you can get some levels on every mule and equip weight reduction perks, but it will take you longer. I don't recommend to use just one mule for everything, but it is your decision. So you need to collect armor pieces like this and any unyielding to level your new characters faster. Using temporal mule you can farm armor pieces, caps, steam packs, etc. So to be able to run to instances of allowed on your computer you need to copy paste these two files. Go there and copy paste this two. And later, one by one, double click on both exe files. But I'll leave a link below on a Reddit article. So check it out. Well, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and Christmas as well on Sunday are coming. There will be some discounts from Bethesda. If you need to transfer your gear, here you have a solution. And if you are addicted to Fallout First subscription or to cosmetic from Atom Shop, I wish you the best. But if someone uses private walls to transfer their gear and scrap box to have more space in their stash, think about paying just once. I bought the second account for almost same price that I paid to be able to play some black metal in front of top of the vault. And black metal is my addiction, so I wish the best to myself as well. Thank you. See you later.